Spencer with FrontsideTrackNews.com. I'm post race here at Sunset Speedway August 3rd with, I think, a, a dude that surprised a lot of people here tonight in his return to Sunset Speedway. First race in, what, 10 months? 10 months. 10 months. Knock the rust off. Sixth place finish here tonight. The SMG Motorsports representative of the frequent flyer, Sean Grossman. Sean, you're all smiles my, right now, my friend, and for good reason. You've got yourself a hot rod. That number 29 cover is moving tonight. Uh, we're really happy with it. The guys worked hard on it all week long, and uh, Ryan's been relentlessly working on it. And uh, we came out this morning, tested, and it was great all day. I mean, from a guy that had to transfer into the feature by winning the B main, you were in the conversation all night. You were, I mean, in the top five. You got sort of pinched right at the, right at the end there for a, for a sixth place finish, but. You were, were, were in all likelihood a top five car here tonight, qualified out of the B main. I mean, it just seemed as though the more time you spent on track, the better this car got. It was, uh, yeah, I mean, we had to knock the rust off the, the driver. And uh, so, you know, we went smart. We didn't want to wreck anyone's championships. Again, we did drop in, so we wanted to be fair to everyone today. And we gave room, and we're really happy. Now, okay, so the car's got a new look. The, the chassis, though, is still the same from, from 2013. Have you made some upgrades to it? Uh, let, let, dish a little bit. Give me some information we on went, this new uh, car. The same chassis. We, we typically like to send it to McCall's for an update, uh, and, he, and he did some changes to the front end to us the back, for the forest and the back end. And uh, other than that, it's the same car, just updated. So we find ourselves in the hauler right next to this number 16 fire seat, familiar looking number 16 car. Talk to me about this new relationship with Flying Ryan Kimmel and the, and the Ryan Kimmel Motorsports squad and, and how this is going to shake out for, for 2014 and beyond. I mean, it's phenomenal. I mean, we had such a good time today. The camaraderie, all the guys came back from last season, all the same crew guys. Ryan's preparing the car during the week and uh, and keeping it and housing it in his shop. And, and the time he puts in is just phenomenal. And, and it's it's just a, a, an amazing vibe here. I mean, did it just feel like getting back in this car was like putting on an old pair of shoes or what? I mean, you, you did not yeah. look uncomfortable for a, a nanosecond. No, it was great. I mean, uh, and you know what? I had the opportunity of racing with literally the best guys in the country, short track racing. And they gave me room. I gave them room. I mean, it was really nice to be up front with those guys. Now, you actually started the, the afternoon or the morning off probably not the way you were hoping to. I walked inside that thick Exxon Valdez-style oil oh. strip heading back to your pit pad. What, what happened there this morning? It was uh, just a, a bolt that came loose. Luckily, it didn't damage the motor. We dropped about seven liters of oil down in the pad here. Luckily, it was mostly here, so the motor had oil pressure. And, you know, my engine miller from Stefco Racing Engine showed up, made sure everything was fine, and we're good to go. Now, as soon as people see that you're back, you're going to get inundated I'm sure with Facebook messages and Twitter private messages wondering when you're going to be back so let's just get that out of the way right now when will we see this gorgeous number 29 car back at Sunset Speedway it, it's a work in progress I sort of have to talk to Ryan Ryan's uh, doing very well out at Peterborough and uh, leading championship and because we're running his teammates I want to make sure I, I don't put any undue pressure on him to bring the car out but I, I, you're going to see us again it's just uh, we'll look at the timeline now and figure out what works for everybody I know that none of this works without the proper marketing partners thank the people that make all this possible Landing strip for your eyes only, Rylex Glass and Mirror, Flagship Property Ventures, SMG Motorsports, Ryan Kimball Motorsports, and thank Wally Jansen, Ryan's car owner, for allowing him to come out and have some fun with us. Now, I know you're a huge social media guy. Where can we follow you on social media? SMGMotorsports.com. Uh, Facebook at SMG Motorsports and Twitter SMG Motorsports 29. There you go, folks. If you have him on Facebook, message him and bother him until we can get him back out here at Sunset Speedway. Let Sean Grossman know you want to see him back. The SMG Motorsports number 29. New look. This car, it's a work of art. Got a bag little motor. I can't wait to see you back here at Sunset Speedway, my friend. Sixth place finish here tonight. Sean Grossman, the frequent flyer. Thanks so much.